So my father is still a mystery to me, even though he's um, in his mid 80s. Um, if you met him, he was a very stern, orthodox Hindu Brahmin. Uh, and yet he had this other side. He um, was a, a great salesman and he used to moonlight for a time as an amateur magician. And um, as young uh, children, my sisters and I got conscripted into the service to become his assistants, which was very odd because if you met him at another time, there was no way that you, would, you could tell that K.H. Shankar, or as he would come to be known when he moved to America, Sam um, had this other side. And so this poem, which is a villanelle, one of the few that I've written, uh, is about my father and uh, my time as a magic assistant. It's called Sam the Super. You wouldn't take my bald father for a quirky man, since his bearing is quintessentially Tamil Brahmin, a tambram for the uninitiated, with the firmest hand when it comes to discipline or studies. He leers at ham and beer alike, believes what genes conspire within him make him purer than you. Not the sort of man you'd ever imagine would, in top hat, willingly stand in a Chinese restaurant smelling of wet dog and ramen to pull silk scars from his mouth with his own hand. Yet there he was, amazingly like Borat in Kazakhstan, but without the parody, and much to my young chagrin, playing the part of magician much more than mere man. I was his caped and turbaned assistant, who he'd demand tap on boxes, say magical phrases, hide in a flower bin he'd saw in half. If not a spectacle witness firsthand, I wouldn't have believed it either. Soon, though, he'd pull out a cyan hanky to mop his brow in the parking lot, and his large grin would fade to a frown. He'd warn me, not to say man or dude. When I resisted, he pulled me back to the car by his hand.